Hey YouTube family, I hope you all are doing well. Welcome back to our daily hacking news series. Hit the like button to give a shout out to our team. Now let's get right into video. So first news is related to Anon Musk. So basically on my first 2022, NB65, one of the Anon Musk affiliate hacktivist group, published a tweet in which it claims to have gained access to Kiwi database for Operation OP Russia. So for your information, Kiwi is a a Russian giant that provides payment and financial services in Russian and Commonwealth of Independence State CIS countries. So basically it is, it is uh, worth noting that NB65 is the same group that had hacked Russian state-run television and radio broadcasting VGTRK or you can say all Russia state television and radio broadcasting company in April 2022 and they have leaked approx 786 GB worth of data online. This is huge. So let's see how they are responding. Now the next news is related to Russian hacking forum. So basically the cyber security researchers have shed light on the activity maintained remote access trojan called DC rat, which is also called as drug crystal rat that offers on sale for dirt cheap price, making it accessible to professional cyber criminals group and novik actor alike. So basically the blackberry researchers said in a report that so they have said that unlike the well-funded massive Russian threat group crafted custom malware, this remote access trojan appears to be worked of a lone actor and offers a surprisingly effective homemade tools for opening backdoor on a budget. So this is huge. I guess Russian hackers are working very hard in the uh, dark side, uh, dark web you can say. Now the next news is coming from Ukraine. So basically the computer emergency response team of Ukraine, which is called CERT UA. So they have warned of phishing attacks that deployed an information stealing malware called Gister Stealer on compromised systems. So the mass email campaign carried the subject line chemical attack on contains a leak link to a micro enabled Microsoft Excel file and opening which leads to computer getting infected with Gister Stealer. So basically the attack which requires potential victim to enable macros after opening the document works whether downloading and executing an exe file that is retrieved from compromised web resources so they have a cert ua basically detailed all this thing and you can see on the image uh, screen as well now next news is related to conti ransomware so basically the costa rican president rodrigo chavez has declared a national emergency following cyber, cyber attack from Conti ransomware group on multiple government bodies. So basically the bleeping computers also absorb Conti publishing most of the 672 GB dumps that appears to contain government belonging to the Costa Rican government agencies. So the declaration was signed into the law by Chavez on Sunday, um, May 8 and same day uh, as the economist and former minister of finance effectively become the country's 49 and current president so this is huge conti ransomware is uh, just uh, doing a lot of tabai all over the world so that's all for today i hope you found this video helpful if yes comment on the feed you may subscribe because bringing hacking news on daily basis so at last thanks for watching this video have a great day jai Hind.